Hello, this is Clay from Popel's Backyard Farm. I want to give you a little update on the, the brooders that I worked on. The tote brooders. Well, what I did is I put them up on um, my saw horses, connected a two before on each side, put the, the totes on it. From this end, you'll see that there's two of them. And uh, what I did is I cut the lid off so that you can uh, lift them up and down and I have the light in there on each one I just had the towel draped across the back so if I have to cover it up for more heat I have my, my probe in there right now I don't have the lights on because the chicks aren't here yet about two more days just room temperature and the probe inside outside little probe it just drops down through the wire you see the probe and that'll check the temperature down in the bottom what I've got for the first two days to three days I've got some lids off in a bucket now these have got a nice little concave top on them so if I fill this with with a uh, feed they're only about a half an inch high and the chicks can still get up over it and get into it to feed. Got one for each one of them. I'll have the water water dishes for them and uh, I figured with 70 of them it would be kind of crowded all in one thing so I'm going to put about probably put about 35 in each each bucket 35 to 40 depending on how many come because sometimes they give you extra so that'll ease up the cramp quarters for them. I just wanted to show you what I did to uh, accommodate for the, the babies. So this will all be ready when I've got them both hooked up. The heat lamps hooked up to a, uh, a switch so that when... The post office calls me, I can call Ruthie, she can hit the switch, turn the light on, and everything will be warm by the time the babies get here. And we can go ahead and do what we have to do to get them housed. Okay, when the chicks get here, we'll show you what we're doing to get them housed. Okay, this is Clay from Popel's Backyard Farm. Follow us and give us a thumbs up and we'll keep you informed of what's going on when the babies get here. Okay, bye-bye.